Hello YouTube. Um, today I'd like to talk about the switch from PC to Mac. And not the computer itself, but the operating system. So more like Windows XP to Mac OS X. Sorry. Um, so the first thing I'd like to talk about is how everything is so much faster simpler and more organized on Mac. Um, on my old PC I had Windows XP and there were icons all over the desktop which was fine. I mean I didn't get to see my nice background picture like I do here. I get to see my whole picture not covered up with icons. On Mac I get to see the icons I want to on my dock and then the rest I use every now and then are in my applications folder. So I can choose where I want everything to be and when I can access it. And I get to see my nice picture across my screen. Um, files, when I was finding them on the Windows XP, on my Windows computer, which I still have, it's downstairs, the files were very hard to find. I had a lot of files, whether it be photographs, videos, Word documents, they were all over the place in different folders. When I click file save as, they would go into folders I didn't choose. I don't know how it happened. I mean, I'm tech savvy and this still happens. I don't, I don't know. But on my Mac, I save a program. It goes to my documents. It's very simple. Click save, blah, blah, blah. Um, I downloaded a free word processor called Bean. It's very nice. Um, which brings me to my second point. It's so much easier to get work done on a Mac. I don't know if it's just because I'm excited to use programs on my new MacBook, but on this program, Bean, I, I launch it, I type a stuff, uh, homework up, it comes out to a page, I print it on the printer that came with my MacBook, and that's it. On my PC, I launch Microsoft Word, I type up a 10-page document that I had a report for Global, and what does Word decide to do? It decides to unformat the whole thing, and even though I click double line spacing, it takes maybe a random paragraph and puts it to triple line spacing, even though it's set to double line spacing. I highlight that whole thing, I don't know. So it's very, very easy to get work done on a Mac. My third point is that the computer doesn't crash. My PC always crashed all the time. I don't know, because it had it was just a crappy model. But, you know, in general, it was just a very slow computer. My Mac, I launch Safari, comes up in a second, literally a second. Um, and that goes for most of the other programs on here. The software available for Mac, in my opinion, I mean, this may differ for all of you guys, but in my opinion, the software developed for Mac is of higher quality than software developed for PC. Uh, if I look at some free programs I've downloaded, I have, you know, some basic photo editing, um, stop motion. If you saw a What's In My Doc video, which I have posted, you'd see some of them. Uh, Bean, you know, uh, Skype. I mean, some of these programs are for PC as well. I feel they work better on Mac. And, you know, let's say I download a free program on PC. Here's how it goes. I download the program. Do you want the ask.com toolbar? No, I don't want the fucking ask.com toolbar. Okay? I don't want spam. I don't want free download this, free download that. I just want my program. I don't want a free trial. I don't want 30 day blah, 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 blah. I just want the program. For Mac, the program I click download. It takes 30 seconds. Downloads into my downloads folder. Drag it into my applications folder. That's it. Some of them have trials, but they tell you that on the website instead of when you download it and then it's a free trial. And the programs that don't have trials and are just free are way better on Mac. That's my opinion. If you defer, comment down below. I'd love to hear your opinions, honestly. I feel, once again, that Mac is a very stable computer. Uh, it doesn't crash, and I just feel it's very stable. <clears throat> there are like no viruses on Mac. Uh, 
there, I'm not going to say there are no viruses because I know there's an exception or two. But I haven't experienced any yet. I've had a couple viruses on my PC, um, which are pretty annoying, I'll just say. Uh, and I don't have to worry about downloading um, virus software on my Mac, which is nice. I don't have to pay like $100 a year for virus software. I love the multi-touch trackpad. Uh, works very well. I'm using it right now. What? 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 Wiki? Wiki? Okay. And uh, I mean, this is only for the MacBook, not for like the iMac or whatever. But I just like to say that it works amazingly. Not that that has to do anything with this video, but Wi-Fi. Very easy to set up on my PC. I'd have to like enter like ten different passwords, security, blah blah blah, blah blah, blah. and it's just confusing. Here, I just go to my top. The tool bar, tool bar, the toolbar at the top, click the Wi-Fi icon, choose the network, enter the password, that's it, done, connected to the internet, post this video. <laughs> so, very easy for Wi-Fi. The last thing I'd like to say before I end this video is that I think Mac is designed more for the individual person. Uh, that might sound pretty corny, but I'm just going to say it anyway. I mean, when I think of PC, honestly what comes to the top of my mind is business. I don't know why. I mean, there's a lot of programs for individual people, creative people on Windows. I just feel that Mac stresses the importance of the individual more than PC. The programs developed for it sorry, are more individual friendly, um, just nicer. I mean, you see a lot of small businesses with Macs. Um, but you don't really see large businesses with Macs, and that's not the point I'm trying to get at. Um, I just think the pro programs are way more creative on Mac. They let an individual person do a lot more than they can on a PC. I love the Mac. I think it's very allows me to do a lot of creative things. And the last thing I have to say is that the icons are very sexy, and you cannot not agree with that because they are. So thanks guys for watching. Remember that the icons are very sexy. So thanks guys for watching. Remember to rate, comment, and subscribe. Peace! What? Oh, okay.